right, now the story everybody's talking about today. $600 million will be up for grabs for tonight's Powerball drawing. That's enough to buy a super yacht or a sports team or even your own personal island, maybe. NBC4's Annette Ariola live in Altadena. That was a hot spot. They sold that billion-dollar ticket a couple of years ago. We were yeah. talking about it uh, with Shauna, yes. Annette, and we were saying that guy bought a beautiful home in the hills. I don't know what you would do with a billion dollars. This one's a little bit less, right, in terms of the jackpot. Uh -oh. Uh, yeah, a little bit less, but but just enough to make Annette happy. Yes. I would retire, retire. I get my kids math tutors and buy a chalet in the French Alps. So that's my plan, Macalo. Uh, we'll discuss yours. And by the way, I would donate a million dollars to the producer Joan Park Foundation to have her do an early retirement as well. But enough of that. We are at Joe Service Center in Altadena, the corner of Fair Oaks and Woodbury. This is Macalo. Where the winning ticket was sold for two billion dollars back in November of 2022. Mr. Joe, good morning to you. Good All morning. smiles. Are you feeling lucky? Do you feel you will be selling the winning ticket this time around? I always smell the moisture coming. Moisture with the money, so I'm so excited. That's why I come early in the morning, dreaming I'm gonna sell another winner. Oh, you know what? But those dreams could turn into reality because Mr. Joe tells me that he too you plays, right? You yeah, play as well. Yeah, of course, everybody plays. We are a human being. We try to get uh, winners. Why not? And you say that if you don't if play, you don't play, you never. If you not, you never win it. Okay. If you don't play, you never win. So you must try. And. A Play with responsibility. Of course, of course. Now, you tell me that since the last uh, winning ticket in November of 2022, it was dramatic. Y your life has changed because thousands of people come now here to buy their tickets here. Every day of my life changed when I'm with the public, with the people, talking to people and offering them good luck and smile and happy. We join together with all the good things. I'll see positive vibes. And by the way, Mac, if we don't take it tonight, we have a chance for Tuesday night. Check this out here. Mega Millions topping it off at $875 million. There hasn't been a Mega Millions winner since last December. So who knows? We feel moisture. We feel money in the air, according to Mr. Joe. And guess what, McCallo? We got a good chance, right? Because we got history here at NBC for many years ago. Not too many, maybe yeah. 13, 14 years ago, we had that overnight uh, overnight assignment editor that hit it big. She won the jackpot. Now she's retired. Sure, very, very happy. So <laughs> maybe we can follow in her footsteps or I could follow in my father-in-law's footsteps. He didn't win a big, big jackpot. It was $20,000 in wow. a scratcher. So I may just drag him out of bed. They live in Moreno <laughs> Valley. Bring him out here to Joe's Service Center in Altadena and have him pick my number. So again, feeling good vibes. You just have to hang around Mr. Joe here and you feel such positive energy. Come on out here, guys. We'll send it back to you. So close to being lucky. Hopefully, lightning will strike twice for you, Annette. Hopefully. Thank you so much. You never know. <laughs>